This is Matrix Lord 212. So, Disney Plus does not want to deal with this whole faction of radical Whovians talking about ratings. Right now, their attention is diverted to Star Wars Acolyte. And they are dealing with all the crap that goes with that. And in that sense, are agreeing, really, with fans. Because they want to make some changes. They want to do some stuff. So... They definitely don't want to take on the Whovians battling about the ratings and talking about that. They just want to deal with about the Star Wars nonsense right now and all these other stuff that they're trying to change the company and change this and change that and cancel this and cancel that of like Marvel movies and Marvel shows, not Doctor Who. So um, Doctor Who is commissioned they're not saying it because they don't want to bring any. The moment Russell T. Davis says that Doctor Who's commissioned for season three, you're going to have 50 videos pop up on YouTube from all the radical Whovians talking about ratings. They're going to make a big stink for him to get fired. And that's the problem. Just like that other one guy. One guy made a video saying that Russell T. Davis was sacked. Well, guess what? It's June 11th, 2024. The guy's talking about season three. If that doesn't mean he's not sacked, I don't know what does. Why do you believe these imbeciles that lie and make up shit for views and videos that is not real in reality in any way, shape, or form? If you're fired from a show, you're not going to be working on the show. And you're definitely not going to be writing the show. You're definitely not going to be the boss. Okay? So he is the showrunner. Russell T. Davis, he is still the showrunner, still the writer. Stop believing people for views, okay? This is what they do. And he's mad and he's angry. He sent all his people after me on my comment section because I proved him wrong. And I don't care what he has on his secondary channel, which is his main channel that has 30,000 fucking subscribers. If you don't have 30,000 subscribers watching you and you have 30,000 subscribers, then it means absolutely shit. So I don't really care about that. So... You're not going to go and make a video that Russell T. Davis is sacked. And he's not sacked. Okay, for views. And he got views of our right. And he also got a whole faction of people that spinned off on his video and started making shit their own. So here's the thing. When you're doing the Doctor Who news, okay, any fucking body can read from, like, say, Anchorman's reading the teleprompter. You're all copy and pasting all your own shit from the fucking articles in a magazine. I could fucking read the magazine and come on here and say, Radio Time says that Russell T. Davis is making season three of Doctor Who, but it's not commissioned. And they're all repeating the same thing. You want to know an example of this? They're all telling you when Shooty's filming Doctor Who after he finishes the play. But nobody covers the fact that he got hired for a movie. He's going to be filming a movie after the play. Nobody says that. So all their information's outdated. We don't know when they're going to film Doctor Who because he's doing a movie too. But he is filming, but he's going to do it after the movie. But you don't hear them say that. No one's talking about the movie he got hired for because they're reading an old effing article that's outdated. Stop following these people that are reading antiquated fucking information. They all want to be these journalists. They all want to be these head Whovians. And nobody gets it right. They're all full of shit. I was told Doctor Who was commissioned season three. I fucking actually spoke to fucking people in the BBC. I have fucking people that spoke to the main people that you need to worry about and talk about. They're not going to fucking dare fucking come out here and say it. And Disney Plus is not going to announce it because they don't want to deal with this nonsense. They're dealing with enough nonsense that people are watching their every move in their um, writer's room, in their rooms where they, they're like a civil war in Disney. They want to get rid One faction wants to get rid of Disney Plus, other faction doesn't. One faction wants to get rid of half the Marvel movies, the other one doesn't. They're going to war with themselves. They're dealing with the public. They're dealing with the Star Wars nonsense of the Acolytes, uh, Acolyte, whatever. And they don't want to deal with that. So they're just not going to tell you. No announcement. Paid for it already. Go film Russell. That's it. And then you'll just see it when the time comes. You will see Doctor Who now. You'll see Doctor Who at Christmas. You'll see Doctor Who in 2025. You'll see Doctor Who in 2026. 
just warp here. They're not announcing anything. Take care. Bye for now.